So then, Gary, what are we doing today? Well, that's a little bit of a flick round, isn't mm. it? Because we're going to do a little bit of a review. So no okay. race. So you would think with these out and a junior hacksaw and a piece of steel armoured, yep. it looks like you've set me up for a race. But yes. no, we're going to have a little bit of a maybe masterclass. Maybe change it up a little bit. Now, this is this is uh, ringing a bell here because this is taking me back to when we did one of our product roundups, wasn't it? And we uh, had a very quick look at the CK armour slice. And if memory serves, I was a little cynical about it. I don't think it was absolutely brilliant. I am more than ready and more than happy to change my opinion in the light of new evidence. So you're going to give me some new evidence today, Gary? I've never used one. Okay. So, so there you go. There's the, there's the benchmark leveller that I'm going to attempt to make off an end of a steel armour cable using the CK armour slice. And then we can review how easy it is first time. I'm not out of the packet. We'll leave that one in there because there's something about leaving them in the packets, isn't there? <laughs> it's actually a, a prize. So we'll leave oh, that nice. where it is. So Good. this is the one we did the review on. Okay. So I'm going to attempt to make off a steel armour cable using the uh, CK armour slice for the very first time live on camera. Let's get on it. Come on in, Gary. Impress me. Wow me with the CK armour slice. Afraid not a whole chap. Goodbye, old friend. <laughs> and we know how I, I, I like a traditional tool because we've had plenty of races where Absolutely. I've taken on you with the uh, traditional yep. tool versus the, the yeah. newer tech. Yeah, and I, I, I love all the newer tech. I think it's really interesting to see new things, but we're gonna you're going to wow me with the CK armour slice. Yeah, we are. So we'll take an approximate length there. So it doesn't matter what we're terminating. It's a technique. Okay, so we'll wind her open and we'll slide her on down to there and then according to the instructions we clamp it up and yep. it says that these do it from I think is it 12 mil to yeah. 30, 36? Uh, yeah I think it's 12 to 36 mil. So okay yeah, so that's the diameter obviously there's no 12 mil conductors. <laughs> or just a 36 the mil cable, 36 mil millimeter squared cable yeah. So uh, again I've, I've watched Chris from CJR shop do this yep. and, and he still gave it a little turn even though when mm. I read the back of the instructions it said you should get it at one tension and just keep going and going and going so yeah. I think that's where there's a bit of learning curve. Because I think, I think this is actually kind of sprung inside here I think the head is kind of self um, referencing kind of thing it kind of moderates itself as it goes around okay so right let's get let's let's give it a go shall go we? so we're gonna go around so we should hear it bite into those armors we're well, not yet oh can you hear it I can hear a little yeah yes. bit of a graunch there so yeah, around good. we go yeah so like so very reminiscent of the sound of a hacksaw there. yeah well it's a hacksaw blade in there isn't mm -hmm. it Okay, so around we go, and this is the bit that I won't know, is obviously how many times and whether yeah. I'm meant to tighten it a fraction as I go. Yeah. So I'm just going round, and then obviously we'll use the knife to yeah. move the outside. And of course there is, a, there is a right and a wrong way to turn this as well, isn't yeah. it? You've got to follow the direction of the arrow. Yeah, there's an arrow there, there that says, yeah, we're going that way, yeah. okay. Which is counterintuitive, because it's the opposite way for the hacksaw yeah, blade, isn't absolutely. it? Yeah, absolutely, So as we go around, okay, like so. And again, this is a bit I don't know. So yeah. how many of these times you do it? And everyone I've spoke to about these have said that you need about yep. three or four attempts and you got it. Yep. Whereas obviously I'm on attempt one. So I'm just saying, however, <laughs> however many times you've seen this on camera, double it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna go, editing. <laughs> I'm gonna give you what it is. This is this is M1 Joe. So okay. Here we go. So let's have a let's loosen the back off. Okay, so you reckon you're through now, yeah? Well, I don't know, do I? Because I've never done one before. Find out, exciting times. So let's take so I'll that, take that, that off. back and then I'm gonna get the knife there. Take my knife. Okay. Away from your thumb. Towards a chum. <laughs> Get right back to this one. Okay, oh, look oh, at that. Just, just, uh, that. I just, just pushed it off. Okay, Beautiful. so we're in that position. And actually, there. looking at that. Yep. Yeah, I can see there we've got some nice clear scoring. Yep, yeah, clear scoring. It did move up and down. It's a very short length, so obviously I've just pushed the armour in back in there. Yep. We've only got an off cut here. Um, and yeah, and then we'll just do the usual technique to, in order to break them off. Should yeah, we do that next? Let's see how many yeah, so come away. Whether well, there'll be any of those rogue little ones that always hang on after you've finished, maybe. Yeah, yeah. So we'll give it a go. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. That's pretty good. Yeah, so it just, just breaks, it, breaks away. Yep. And. Yeah, they're coming off reasonably cleanly, aren't they? That's mm. quite impressive. Hmm. Okay, so with, with, them, with them all, uh, that's not bad. A reasonable effort. The, yeah. the issue is not they're not all, and this is not all round yeah. on the end, because obviously it's such a short piece of armour, as we move it left and move it right, yeah, they get a little bit longer. Little bit, yeah, yeah, okay, so, but that's, that's broke off really neatly. Yeah, they've come off quite well. So the rest of the technique, yeah, mind yourself there, young man. The rest of the technique just requires to put an armour gland on. I don't think that's, I don't think that's yeah. the video, is it, really? No, that's the video is standard. so... Yeah. The question was really posed to you, you, you know, could you be made right by knowing whether these are any good? So I've had one attempt, mm. I've made a reasonable effort first time out and I've never used one before. So do you think it was user error when you had a go? Uh, let's say yes, shall okay. we? If I do remember rightly, I think the armoured cable I made off was very, very thin, the mm. diameter of it. I think it might have been less than 12 mil actually, ah, so maybe, maybe, that maybe that's, that's why. That's yeah. the problem. 
So what I would suggest is comment below if you've used these, mm -hmm. comment below if you love these, comment below if you've uh, struggled with these in the past. But yeah. as a, a first out of the packet, I'm going to say, yeah, not bad, Joe. Okay.